Graduation is right around the corner, less than three weeks away. People are already marking their calendars. It feels like yesterday we were just in seventh grade or something. <laughs> yes. But now, in the blink of an eye, graduation. So many mixed emotions. Like, I'm a little sad, I'm a little excited, but like, it's like, dang, like, I'm done already? You know what I mean? <laughs> Yeah. It's crazy. Some may call that feeling of being done senioritis. Senioritis? Um, I don't really know about senioritis, but I do know there is a thing called senior depression. For good reason, there is so much to do planning for what's next. So, I, go, growing up, I knew exactly where I wanted to go my entire life. And then uh, about six months ago, I was told... Uh, that I was going to get free admission to UK. Mm -hmm. uh, so it kind of changed my entire life plan. And it was, a, it was like a big shift for me, but it was good. Deadline with acceptance and, in some cases, rejections. Like, I didn't get accepted. This place isn't for me. So yeah. maybe the path that on my life, this probably wasn't meant for my path. Lessons preparing them for life. So wherever you end up is where you're supposed to be, and you're here for a reason, and even though it might not be where you want it to be, you have to make the most of it. So that's how I try to look at it. High school graduation may be the end of one chapter, but it's the new beginning of something new and exciting. <laughs> I get to take control of who I want to be. Mm -hmm. When you live under your parents' house, and when you live under rules that you might not be too fond of, or you just feel like you don't get to be as expressive as you can, mm -hmm. that is one thing I'm excited about, is to just blossom and become who I want to be without yes. people having to say, tell me who 